This, this video is about how to compress your images for a web. Oftentimes you might use a web page like Compressed JPEG or Photoshop to make the image smaller. This photo here is about 1.6 megabytes. It's way too high for any website. Um, I would suggest under 400, 300 kilobytes per image on a website. So I've added it here to compressjpeg.com and it looks like it's compressed it by 22%. Let's see how low that is. So this is the minimum file and it's 5.3 megabytes. It's really way too high. So here it is in Photoshop. Let's try it there instead. So file, save as. And now I can lower the quality from 10 megabytes to 1 megabytes. So clearly that's really not low enough and I won't be able to add this photo to my website. The, the issue here is not about compressing the quality of the image but actually resizing the image. So to do that we're going to go to image image size and do 1800 and if I do a 2000 it's still going to be pretty good. Now let's try to save it. Yeah so I can get it down to 200 kilobytes and I'm okay with that. If you don't have Adobe Photoshop, you can use bulkresizephotos.com and I find this really works really well. You can add a bunch of photos at once and you can compress the quality in the size. So I'll show you. So you can change the width here, image format, image quality, image dimensions, here. If you, this is really good for uh, WooCommerce if you have very specific sizing for your products, uh, they, which they do, so that you can uh, resize them all the same size. You can do it by file size, no more than, you know, 300 kilobytes. <laughs> so yeah, there's a lot of options here. Check it out, bulkresizephotos.com. Well, it's been great uh, helping you guys. I hope you liked this video. If this helped you compress and resize and make your photos smaller, please like and subscribe.